On January 22nd, 1982, uh, my best friend was born. He truly, he was so wanted. Um, he was the love of my life. Dominic had so many qualities, it's hard to describe him, even just counting down to five of them. But one of his biggest qualities was his genuine love for everybody. What do you get out of volunteering? Is it something you get individually out of each one, or is it sort of an overall global thing? It just, it's an overall gratification of the work that I do, the people that I get to work with. <sighs> that's, that's probably the hardest one of the day. I think I know what I want to say, I just can't say it. Mm -hmm. I always knew Dominic would have a room here. Um, and he still does. It became our guest room, our little office, or my little room where I do interviews from. And it, it has a calming effect. People sleep in it and they say, I just slept so well. It, it has a good vibe and I'll show you why. first officer that showed up was Dominic's best friend, who he wanted to become a motorcycle cop with, and then work as a helicopter pilot. The second officer showed up and he knew Dominic. So it didn't just destroy my life, it destroyed others' lives. And um, the fire department showed up. They couldn't deal with it because Dominic was one of their volunteer firefighters. He was one of their family members. The DA knew the killer of my son. He had dealt with him before, he gave him deals. The judge knew the killer of my son and they all worked together and gave him a misdemeanor without gross negligence. And he received nine months and five year probation and he served only 35 days. This is the last card. That's where the tattoo came from, from this card. Thank you for all you have done and continue to do for me. Merry Christmas, love, Dominic. And now it is a great honor to introduce our volunteer of the year. Dominic Durden, would you please come up?